Carrie Angle from Valley View Farms is here to answer your plant questions. Hello, Carrie. Hello, Lisa. And we know what she's brought <laughs> along here. Yeah, all kinds of poinsettias. And these are kind of cool. This is, um, I mean, just different varieties you don't think about. This one's called White Glitter. Uh, I think this one's Crystal Ice. This is one of the Princetti ones. I love these smaller mm -hmm. flowers on it. Uh, the next one is actually a natural green. It's called Envy. Mm -hmm. And then the one all the way over is, is called Tapestry. And and we were talking about it before, but right. we cheat and paint some too. Right, you have some Ravens ones, we have right? Some, we have some purple Ravens ones. They start out as white. We spray and put a little bit of glitter on them. Mm -hmm. They'll eventually grow out of it, but hey, fun for a but few it weeks. it won't hurt the plant. No, it won't hurt the plants. Okay. We would not you hurt would plants. You would never hurt a plant. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, let's get to the first question. What are the best vegetables to plant during winter? Huh? As as far as outside, I'd say give it up, come inside and rest. Yeah. If you want to grow some microgreens inside or, you know, maybe even some lettuce and some herbs, you can do that. But mm -hmm. get yourself set up with some lights or have a real nice bright windowsill and you right. can go to town. Chia pet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> there you go. All right. Is it too late to plant winterberry to have a holly bloom by Christmas? Yes. Um, winter berries are blooming now. I mean, so they're full right. of berries right now. You can probably plant one that already has some berries on mm -hmm. it and just cut it as you go. Um, but mine are just starting to lose their leaves. So the leaves have started to turn brown and I'll be able to start pruning them next okay, week. Are we talking displays. about from the holly trees? Yeah, but, winter berry okay. is a deciduous holly. So most okay. holly is evergreen, has evergreen leaves with the red berries. This has the red berries and all the leaves kind of fall off. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's used a lot in decorations for winter and just, you know, just find somebody that has wine and I, I, I need to, I we can come cut yeah, some off yeah, of your no tree. Sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are some great alternate forms of lights for plants when it's too cold outside? You know, anything that you've heard about you can use. Things like LED lights inside, there's uh, halogen lights you can use indoors. Um, and really even just under a countertop, you can go ahead and you know, put something under your cabinets and grow your plants on the countertop and be great. So there's all sorts of things, fluorescent, whatever you might want to use. Mm -hmm. So whatever, and you want something that's going to mimic the day length, like okay. so the right wavelength for use inside. All right, and very good. And plants will love it. And if folks wanted some help uh, with their wreaths, they can come out to Valley View Oh, Farms. absolutely. Yep, we can make bows for you or help you put a wreath together. Or if you want to, you know, start with a decorated one, we can kind of enhance it for you, whatever you want to do. Very nice. And lots of poinsettias. All right. Thank you, Karen. Thank you. All right.